good morning. I'm meteorologist Katherine Maxwell. Not too bad of a start for us this morning. Temperatures mainly sitting actually in the 50s and the 60s for us. So a little bit of a cooler start this morning. Not observing too much on radar, but areas such as like Greenbrier, even a little bit in Raleigh, Fayette County, some areas there could be waking up to a little bit of some patchy fog. But for the most part, starting off dry, most of the day will actually be dry today. But as we had more into the second half of the day, late this afternoon, the evening, a little bit after the sun sets, we will hold on to a few spotty showers out there. Just going with a 30% chance, so not everyone's going to see it. But most of us by the afternoon should have that sunshine move in. Temperature low to mid 70s, so a little bit cooler even with those high temperatures too. We'll be breezy at some times. We'll have a northerly northwesterly flow today, so wind gusts right around 20, 25 miles per hour. That's what we can expect too for us for our Wednesday afternoon. So we had this cold front come through last night. We have a secondary front that's going to swing in. This is going to bring us a little bit of that spotty shower activity later on in the day. Back behind it, we have high pressure. This is going to be the dominant weather maker for us starting tomorrow and continuing into the rest of the work week. High pressure means dry conditions. So we're looking dry, but we'll hold on to this cooler air, all thanks to that northwesterly flow that that should give. Dew points will be on the lower end rest of this work week too, so it will feel pretty comfortable while outdoors, mainly into Friday though. Friday afternoon, we'll start to have the humidity creep back in, and then by the weekend, we'll have those humid values back with us. So overall, if you have any lawn work to do for us these next few days, should pretty much be in the clear. First part of the day today, looking good. But if you do do it after work today, this evening, you may run into a couple of those spotty showers. Wednesday and Thursday though, not looking bad. We actually really don't have any chances for rain for the next several days actually. So overall, we're having some nice weather come our way. Today may have that spotty shower, but that'll be later on in the day. You can see it here on Futurecast. Just a couple of passing showers before the day is completely done. Overnight, we may hold on to a stray shower or two. I think most of us by tomorrow morning should be starting off dry. Temperatures tomorrow starting off in the day, so lows overnight, mainly sitting into the 50s, so looking a little bit of a cool night tonight. Tomorrow, we'll keep up with these cooler temperatures in the upper 60s and the 70s. We have our second name storm for us for the Atlantic hurricane season. Tropical Storm Bill looks to mainly head up to the northeast, so shouldn't really impact the United States. May provide some high surf conditions, though, along the coast. But this looks to head more into Newfoundland. We do have another system close to the Cabo Verde Islands. 20% chance of cyclonic development. Then as we head into the Gulf, close to Mexico, a 70% chance within the next five days. That's going to give us a little bit of rain into our Father's Day weekend. So next several days, looking fairly dry. Then we'll have some tropical moisture interacting with a few frontal systems nearby throughout the weekend. That's going to bring back that humidity, some warmer temperatures, and also some showers and storms.